Hi friends, it's Deanna here today, and today we're talking about swim patterns. Swim patterns. And we're talking about adult swim patterns on this uh, video. Um, we all have come to love Ellie and Mac patterns, and we're getting ready to draw. S -s draw. Draw. If you could just draw it and then wear it. And we're getting ready to sew some swim patterns, and you know, you're a little bit scared about swim. Well, L.A. Mac is the perfect company for you because we have such simple instructions, great patterns, great fit, and I'm going to show them all to you so you know which one you want to grab and sew. You'll probably want all of them, to tell you the truth. So, let's get started. <laughs> All right, so first off is the Oasis pattern. This is super cute pattern. Um, it's simpler, but like El like other Ellie and Mac patterns, we've got different options. So this one's got two different options. So one of the options is the two-piece. Um, the two-piece comes with the bottoms. They're a little bit high-waisted, and it comes with a crop top uh, kind of top. Um, it's kind of like in the shape of the straight at the top and well I'm going to show it to you so you can actually see it and you're kind of picturing what I'm trying to talk about. Um, but yeah and then it's got the crisscross straps that will go through the loops and you will be crisscrossed in the back so you can make it tighter or looser depending on how you want to wear it. Um, it is super simple and great um, quick sew. I'm going to attach as I'm going to say this now um, as I'm talking about these patterns, I will be attaching a link at the top for um, the sewing tutorial. So if you say, oh, I really want to sew this pattern, but I'm a little bit afraid to sew it by myself, come join me as I sew them up. The link will be above and um, you can sew it with me. Okay, and then the second option of this pattern is the full option, which is like a plunging neckline um, one piece, I couldn't think of the word, full option, one piece is what we call that usually. Um, and it, it's super cute as well and super easy to sew. So you've got those two awesome options for this pattern. I think you can't go wrong with either of those. All right, next we're gonna talk about the waterfall. And I'm telling you, this is probably one of my favorite uh, patterns. It is super flattering and super cute. I love the waterfall effect with the flounce around the shoulders. I think it is so, so super cute. I already said that, I'm saying it again, it's super cute. <laughs> and so this one has got also two different options. You've got the waterfall and that's part of the pattern, but you have the option of doing the cropped version where you basically just see the waterfall and a little bit of the tank um, and then the bottoms obviously, but then it also has the option of doing like a tankini where you do the bottom of the, you got the waterfall up top and you got the longer bottom Piece that is also a bit like able to cinch at the side so you can kind of cinch it up if you feel like it or pull it all the way down if you just want to you know cover up from the rays of the Sun you know sometimes we want to do that if we don't want to burn um, sometimes I don't want to do that and I'm stubborn and end up burning um, but <laughs> this is the great swim set for that and just looks super super cute um, and then also I love that it also comes with an option of you could add straps to it if you wanted to um, to kind of help hold it up because it is kind of, it is a off the shoulder pattern and you know sometimes when you're playing at the beach or at the pool um, you if you have children <laughs> you might want to use those straps so in case they cool down on your bathing suit, but it is super cute. And we also have a video on how to sew it all up. All right, y'all next in our lineup is the gather tankini. Now this one is also a super cool suit. Um, it's got tons of different options with it. And that is another thing that I love. Um, I love this one's a little bit more covered up for those who, you know, want to cover up more for the sun or whatnot. Um, and I love that it comes with an option of a, um, skirt, skirted bottom. So we've got the option of the regular um, bottoms and then we've got an option to add a skirt as well if you wanted um, you know more length on them. And then the top is actually a tankini and it's kind of gathered here at the top. Um, it is super cute and actually pretty simple to sew as well. I mean I think sometimes we get a little bit scared when it comes to swim and we're like 
Am I going to be able to do this? Uh, yes, you will be able to do it. And again, we've got the video on it on how to sew it up. So I love this one because it is just fun too. Like if you're going out like on a picnic or if you're going to be out all day in the sun splashing and but doing other things as well, it keeps you comfortable. Um, it keeps you covered from a little bit more covered from the sun and things like that. So you can run around and have fun and not worry about, you know, it falling down or something like that. So um, this is also a great suit. All right, y'all, this next pattern, it's full of options. And I'm talking like full of options. This is the color block sip mix and match swimsuit. Um, this one I super hyper mega love. Um, why? Because it's got so many options. Okay, so it comes with a regular bottom, but it can be a regular bottom, it can be high waisted, so that's an op option. And it's got the option to do color blocking on the side, which looks so cute. And it looks like, you know, you just got that suit from the store, like, whoa, you did that? Uh, yes, I did. Super, super cute. It's one of my favorites because of the color blocking. Um, it also has an option for the top. Now the top, it's got different options with it. It's got a sip up option um, with color blocking option as well. So you can do color block all the, the heck out of it. If you want to color block the bottoms, you want to color block the top. If you don't, you don't have to. These are the options you have. You can color block half of it and not the other half. You can color block your top and not your bottoms. You can color block your bottoms and not your top. It is up to you. You can do the sip up option, which I think is so awesome and fun and cute. But you also, if you say, no, I don't want to do that. I just want to do the simple option. You can do that as well. And it also has an option to add a gathered tankini bottom to your, um, to your top. So it's super cute because you can add, expand from that. You can um, add the, the bottom, okay? So I love, love, love this pattern. I think the options are just so great and it is actually super, super cute. Um, there is a sewing tutorial on it because when it comes to color blocking, well, not because of that. We always have the sewing tutorials, which is awesome. But it also, when it comes to color blocking, sometimes it can get a little bit confusing on thinking which pieces go where. Um, so if you're struggling with that, come check out our sewing tutorial on it and um, I'll try to make it as clear as possible for you. Um, it is adorable. I've made a couple of this ones and it's probably my top favorite because of all the options and especially color blocking. I am obsessed with color blocking. It takes everything to a next level and it makes it look so expensive and like I already said, you made that? Yeah, I did. Super cute. All right, so those are four swim adult swim patterns. Um super cute and tons of different options on those patterns. Um that's Bo over there trying to say hello. He's always trying to join in the fun. Um but Last but not least, I wanted to give you this one because it's needed um, and I love it. So I wanted to point it out and show it to you all. This is the beach cover up. How cute is this beach cover up? Yeah, that's me when I had short hair and it was a lot lighter. <laughs> um, but anyway, it is super, super cute. I love it. It's got this plunging front and plunging back with a strap on the back to, so it doesn't fall off. Um, it's got options of you can add trim at the bottom to make it cuter. Um, not that it's not cute without the trim, but the trim kind of adds a little fun to it, especially if you're going to the beach. Um, it's got this like wallowy kind of sleeves. It's loose fitting, so you can just slide slide it right on and slide it right off when you're ready to go have fun. Um, it can be made with woven fabrics so you can use all those lightweight woven very beautiful fabrics that you see out usually springtime summertime and you're like what do I make with this uh, the beach cover up yes I love it I think it's super cute it is super simple to make um, and I think you're gonna love it. Again, we also have a video for it. So if you're struggling, you say, how do I make that? Um, come check it out and go grab the patterns. I will attach the links to all these patterns below. Um, and you can go ahead and grab every single one of these because I know you're going to want them all because I wanted them all. I've already sewn all these because I love them. Um, so anyway, links below, comment, like, share, subscribe if you haven't so you never miss any of our videos. Let us know what are your favorite, let me know which one which one is your favorite swim pattern if you can pick one um, and then also I hope this was super helpful um, for you to see all the difference of the patterns do not be afraid uh, just jump in and do it I think that sometimes the biggest 
struggle is to actually get started, uh, you know, and, and doing it. And then you'll find that you can do it. And I'm here to help you. So if you have any questions, please comment below. And also come find us on Facebook and Instagram. Our Facebook group is full of love and full of helpful uh, sewists that are just ready to help you if you get stuck with a project. So just come on over and check us out. Um, I will attach that link also below. So if you want to find us on Facebook or Instagram, link will be below. I hope you have a great rest of your day. I hope this was helpful. Get some sewing done today if you want to. If you don't, go ahead and check out our other videos and just do some binge watching. That's good too. <laughs> I hope you have a great rest of your day, like I said earlier, and I'll see you all next time. Bye!